What's going on guys? Welcome to the video. We've got a short update here on a possible general election. Labour will back December general election. As Jeremy Corbyn says, condition for taking no deal off the table has been met. Which is really astonishing, considering absolutely nothing has changed since yesterday when he rejected an election like the Corbynated chicken that he is. Now, the Telegraph, among others, are reporting on this, so we'll take a quick read through it and then I'll continue with the video I was making about last night's Newsnight programme. So, let's see what it's got to say. Labour will back a December election after Jeremy Corbyn said his condition for taking no deal off the table has been met. Following a meeting with his shadow cabinet, the Labour leader said that as a result of the EU agreeing to an extension of Article 50, our condition of taking no deal off the table has now been met. But they agreed the extension before the vote yesterday, so what is it taking for you to change your mind, Jeremy? Oh yeah, certain Labour MPs are being reported as grilling the Commissar for hiding from an election yet again and making the party look stupid. Along with Labour Party members, of course. There are many reports about this this morning. Mr Corbyn told members of his cabinet that he has consistently said Labour would fight an election subject to no-deal Brexit being off the table, which technically it's not, so I don't know what he's saying. We have now heard from the EU that the extension to Article 50 to the 31st of January has been confirmed. So for the next three months, our condition of taking no deal off the table has now been met, he said. Well, technically no, because if Boris Johnson wins a majority, he could theoretically just take us out with no deal. He would have enough votes in Parliament to pass it, so you couldn't take him to court for it. And at the end of the day, there'd be nothing you could do about it. So Jeremy Corbyn... This is not because no deal has been taken off the table. This is because you're being told if you don't go for an election, we're going to get rid of you. That is also being reported in the newspapers this morning. Mr Corbyn told members of his cabinet that he has consistently said Labour would fight an election subject to no deal Brexit being off the table. We will launch the most ambitious and radical campaign for real change our country has seen. Yep, real Marxist change, you know, the sort of change that no one wants. It comes after a number 10 source said the government was willing to back a December 11th election in a push to get tonight's vote through Parliament. The source said Boris Johnson would accept an amendment by the Lib Dems and SNP which would allow an election to take place a day earlier than that originally put forward by the government. So, by the sounds of it, the Labour Party are actually going to back an election tonight. Now, they will likely put amendments on it, including the one that's down here, that says, urgent question on votes for 16-year-olds and EU citizens. Rumours that the SNP and Lib Dem MPs are lobbying the Speaker not to select an amendment expected from Labour to demand votes for 16 and EU citizens. The Sun's deputy political editor, Matt Datham, is hearing that they don't want to look bad by voting against 16-year-olds and EU nationals getting the vote. But they also probably don't want the government to withdraw the bill, because the SNP and the Lib Dems know they are going to win some seats. But this is what we got to expect at the end of the day. There's going to be amendments added to it. The question is, what will they be? Who will they be from? And will they matter at this election? Or will they matter at a future election? Time will tell. But I'll try and keep you updated as best I can as the day goes on. Now, I'm going to end this video there so I can continue on my video about Newsnight, as I said earlier. I want to thank the channel's PayPal, Patreon and Subscribestar members for supporting the channel along with everyone who watches my videos. Remember to let me know what you guys think down in the comment section below. Leave a like, subscribe with the notification bell and share this video as it helps the channel a lot. And I'll see you all in the next one. This parliament is a dead parliament. It should no longer sit. It has no moral right to sit on these green benches. They don't like the truth. Twice they have been asked to let the electorate decide upon whether they should continue to sit in their seats while they block 17.4 million people's votes. This parliament is a disgrace. But they're too cowardly to give it away. But the time is coming. The time is coming, Mr Speaker when even these turkeys won't be able to prevent Christmas. There is a pattern consistent throughout history of oppressed people turning on the oppressors, slaves against their owners, 
the peasantry against the feudal barons, colonies, Mr. Verhofstadt, against their empires. <laughs> and that is why Britain is leaving. And it doesn't matter which language you use, we are going and we are glad to be going. We're off. <laughs>